high tinkerers. You must have taken a lot of black and white printouts, color printouts. But do you know how does a printer work? Or how does the paper come out of the printer? Once it gets printed, how does it come out of the printer? Let's make a small project and understand the science behind it. Okay. So for that, uh, you require a gate motor, okay. a robo wheel. Then you need the junior tinker lab at home bits. Okay. You can use other bits also, it's up to you. I will show one of the ways how you can do it. And then you require a 3 volt uh, battery holder and also the batteries. You can use 9 volt but the speed would be very high. So uh, I would recommend 3 volt again in this. It's up to you. Let's start. Yeah. So first uh, let's make a ruler stand. So these bits actually help to make the stand very easily. Okay. So you can use those things in different ways. So I will try to make a vertical stand. First I'm using the, this bit, this one, then I'll, I want it horizontally also, so I'll use this, that's it, okay. Now I'll insert this motor and the dimensions are in such a way that everything fits into one another, this goes in, yeah, this is there, okay. Now I will connect the wheel and also the axle. Okay, so this is done. Now let's connect it. See the direction and then put it in the gear wheel. This is done. Uh, now ensure that this wheel just touches the ground. Okay, it should not touch uh, totally. Should, uh, there should be some 1 mm gap, small gap between that. Okay. And this is the mechanism. Okay. Then I would require a 3 volt. Ensure that the motor is always, uh, the battery holder is off. When you want, then only you should switch it off. Yeah. Now this is rotating. So I want it still. So if I want it, to rotate here itself, I need to increase the height little bit. I can increase it like this also. Okay, so that there is a gap here. Yes, I can hold it up from the back also. Now it's rotating the wheel, the rubber wheel. Now I have this long paper. Let's see how this rolls out of the thing. Okay. Let's have some design so that you can see when it rolls. So let's see the working. I have the long paper. I'll switch it on. And now let's see. Wow, you can see the paper going. So it's a simple concept of friction. So inside the printer also there are the rubber rollers which are there. There may be multiple. And those because of the frictional force, they take it along. This is so nice, so simple, so easy to uh, have fun with science. Do this project and have your own variants. So you can hold the uh, bit from the back also. So instead this, okay. I have this color printer. 